That's pretty good accomplishment, I think. <sighs> New day in the shop. It's tow truck day again. The rat rod wrecker is getting the cage finished. So I gotta fix this little uh, oops in the middle. Yep. The center of our bend was not center. Bend. Center of bend needed to be an inch this way. I got a sleeve in there. I gotta put those plates on first. And then the upright bars. We get those, the window bars. Get those done first. Then we can start welding the top of this together, build the roof rack. And it'll look like a cage. So we'll get going. So I built this little uh, adapter shim and a sleeve that's inside of it there. It's basically just to get me in the right ballpark for all of this madness that's about to go down here. Now I gotta build these. I think I'll <coughs> measure, find the center of this. We'll come six inches off center, up to here, and we'll find the center of this. I don't know, we're gonna see what looks right. 49 and a half, what's the center of that? Three quarters? Yeah. You nailed it. 24 and 3 quarters. 55 and a half. What's half of 55 and a half? 27 and 3 quarters. That's your center. That's the center of this one. That's the center of that one. So I think what I'm going to do is come 6 inches over. That's where those will come up. They'll be on an angle. Something of that nature right there. All right, first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go get this welded here. We gotta drill holes, so we'll do that. You need this one too? Yep. Right, we got some holes marked in that one. You know what I'm doing this under? So you can weld it. Like because I couldn't measure the first time. Sometimes you just gotta do stuff the hard way in life. That will slide right inside of there, like so. We'll weld all that. This will slide over and weld into there. It'll be like we never screwed up, Hunter. I think I should weld a couple of those and then we'll have to lay it down on the flat table. Get them both clocked properly and weld them together. We're ready to plug well. The reason I used a stepper drill bit, you guys are probably wondering, it makes a little round circle on the outside of this so you can weld it. You grind these off and you can't see them anymore. Just a little trick that I use. Then we're going to space this just barely so I can weld in between it. Weld that onto that. It'll be there for life. That's as close to 90 as I can get it. That should be exactly the same. Just the way everything else is going, should we go put it on? Maybe. Set that up in there for me. Okay. Oh, things, <laughs> things are looking up. <laughs> all, right. all right, I'll go weld all these holes so back. Oh. All right. That's not breaking right there. And it'll have a little solider piece for the two uprights to come up and tie into that. I'll grind those up. Things will look good. Perfect. Now I'm gonna mark these. That's where it's coming through and that's where it's coming through. I'm doing some scientific stuff right here. Basically, I, ooh, that was hot, melted my marker a little. Basically, that's where I need to drill the hole in the center of that, in the center of that, right straight through, and then we'll bend them up in. I'm gonna find my trusty old square. We're doing it. Two more holes in the cab. Those Diablos are no joke. Those things cut. 26 inches of tubing. Get us there. We'll hurry and notch the end of this, and then we'll figure out where the bend's gotta go and put her together. The top and notch is 18 inches. 
All right. Yep, that's that's gonna be enough angle right there. Now I just have to figure out where to cut it off at. Ben's right though. Almost, almost died other than that, it's right. I'm gonna notch this real quick. Man, it's not quite notched right. I gotta go redo that just a little bit. There's still plenty to, to do it with, it just needs that much chop it's not terrible it's got a good gap to weld in there that'll make it tighter right I don't know if these ones are gonna have plates on them I can't that's tight to have a plate underneath of there we may end up just welding the cab to it and then welding that in it's probably how it's gonna go I'll go build another one that may be maybe in the ballpark Guess we'll try that and adjust from there. All right, it needs to be way less than that. And that's the center. That's the center, pretty much. It's close, it just needs to twist a little bit. Right, hand me that other one. Do a little. Oh yeah, we're, we're dang close, we're close to the to where it needs to be. Let's check them out. That one fits better than this one fits. Somebody made that one too short on one end. I actually quite like how that one fits. I may build another one. What does that look like? Looks like I need to cut just a little bit more out of the top of that or the bottom, one of the two. And then it should be good. That's better. Man, this bottom notch is just killing me. It's someone screwed it up. The top's good. That bottom's just terrible. Someone screwed it up? Yeah, Hunter, basically. No, it was Ben. Oh yeah, it probably was Ben. Lord Paul Cox. <laughs> Alright, let's see if this fits. That bottom's way more better. Right about the top of the pipe. You're at 32 so and We're a pretty half. close to 32 and a half. Okay, now we'll just go two and a half inches off. To the insides. To the insides. I think I'm welded in. I'm done. Come look at it first. That's it, it's going in. Parts of the cage are welded. I got one more base there. We got to build the plates and then we can weld the top piece on. It's starting to look like a roll cage. It's getting good. All right, there's, there's one. I'll come over and do that one. We'll cut some holes. And then we got bending to do and more bending. Oh yeah. All right, I'm gonna cut that out. It's gonna get interesting. Beautiful circle. What's that, uh, wedding singer? Life of fucking school. What does he say it on there? No you never seen the wedding singer? Uh, Adam Sandler? I don't think so. Oh, well, you guys are awesome. We're gonna have to have a movie night. <laughs> All right, so a uh, guy's giving us a Toyota Camry. They're really good derby cars, and they're giving, he's giving it to my boys so they can crash it. Fuel pump's dead, something's wrong with it. We'll figure it out. That'll work, we can push it out of the way.
Are you even doing anything over there, Paul? You're not no. even pushing or nothing. I'm not doing anything. He's done. <laughs> That'll work. Yeah, these old frame rails are just straight as can be and tough. They'll love it. They'll crash it. I'll put them to stripping it and they can. We'll figure out what's wrong with it first. Make sure it's worth fixing. Worth fixing. We're custom bending stuff. Looks like it needs to go probably a little more there and some on the back. Alright. It's gonna fit. Wanna bet? Uh no, I think you got it this time actually. It's pretty close. That back corner a little. This whole side a little. I wish you weren't so cold blooded. It's like a million degrees in You're here again. Fine. We're gonna need to get you out. Take you to Canada or somewhere cold. <laughs> I'm not going to Canada. How about like Mexico or <laughs> Bahamas? You can't go there if you don't even know what the singer's reference. Because it's a syrup. Yeah, we heard about the syrup. Yes, we're yeah. familiar with shapes. Are you sure it's Adam Sandler? Because I've seen like all of Adam Sandler's movies. Wedding singer. Look it up. You'll see it. Right there. Nin I can't help it. 1998. No wonder I didn't know. <laughs> Were you even alive? No. <laughs> All right, Hunter. One plate down. I'm about to call that good enough. And then we're going to weld that in. I like it. And then we can weld this in. No. Uh, I can tack it in. And then I'll build this part, take it back out, weld the bottom side, then we can put it in. It's thinking. Is that big green hammer over there? I need it for just a second. She is done. It's hot, but that part is finished. Now I gotta try to deal with that. In the middle, I gotta weld those into the cab and then set this on. Can't, uh, can't weld those, I gotta build the crosses first. There's a lot going on. We're gonna weld these things in and then we'll get going on the rest of it. I'm gonna weld the underside of that. That's not the funnest thing I've welded all day. All right, those are welded in. I'm trying to decide if I weld that in, I probably ought to. Those are fresh holes. I probably should have put something else on. One more, and then we can go to building the top. All right, tack that in place. Come over ah, here. Everything is hot. Oh yeah, it's... Holy cow. There is some heat going on, Hunter. I've been welding for a bit here. That tightened that up. Hand me that green thing right there. Four and three quarters. All right, I need two pieces of inch and a half DOM. That's 34 and three quarters. And we'll put one there, one there, one here, and then we'll put some connectors in the middle of them. And we'll pull it all out, weld it all up, put it back in here, weld it to this, take this out, weld it all up, put it back in, weld it down for the final time. Sounds easy. Let's do it. Thank you. 
top webbed in and then, then we got a one inch. We'll see how that fits. Like I thought, it fits good. You ready to try the roller out? I think it's time, Hunter. We need that to roll with the cab. Okay, let's figure this out. Let me go make some marks. I'm optimistic I've never done this before. We may, we may bend a piece of tube the wrong way, but I hope not. Alright, we're right on six. Do you think it's bent? I don't think. <laughs> I think it's bent a little bit, but that's all we need is a gradual yeah. roll. It's bent. Let's go see if it matches the topper. We're gaining. Well, we gotta go some more on the little thing before we get there. She's bent now. Yeah. There we go. We'll go bend the rest of them to that. Well, the crap, Grader Taylor. Hi. You here to do some tires? Yes, I am. This project you have gutted everywhere in here. What? I want to go drive it. I can see it all. Point you in the right direction. I'm going to bend some tubes real quick. All right. Gonna be pretty good. Let me get a tape measure. We'll start doing some some tacking in place. Shouldn't rattle. Should be okay. That's where that one goes. Okay, there's that one. Great. I need a hammer, buddy. Green one on top of the box. Grab it. Well, we got a package today and it's from Leander S. from Arizona and he sent us RC shocks. We'll use these up when we get them out. Oh, sweet. The good ones, too. Heck yeah. So, thank you. Hey, this thing looks good up here. Got your plates. It looks like you cut this one a little short. Hey. Two. But that's a okay. Labor to land to come and point out all the bad things. Hey, I I'm, I'm just pointing it out, okay? <laughs> what do you think of that? That looks pretty okay on top, doesn't it? Yeah. How many Linda. do you think? Linda. Two in here? Or one across the middle and call it good? Uh, it probably looks better with one. Okay. Honestly. What have you done to me? What, what, what have we done? Well, ten and a half, ten and a half, not ten and a half. You said that one was like well. Yeah, but this one should be, the middle one should be that. Get the death weld, man. Uh, okay. Let's unweld this. You were talking and I was working. doing. I was doing too much. Well, I put that where it needed to go. And I did not put that where it needed to go, folks. That's the problem. There's a mark right there that tells me that. Definitely. <laughs> got it. How much hairspray you got in that thing? Ten and a half. What? Do we stagger them? Do we do like? Put this one there, that one there, that one there. I think that might look cool. I think that's what we do. I gathered six eggs today. Did you? It was that busy, huh? In the rack shop. You could go to the chicken coop. <laughs> We're 
What do you think? I like it. Or do I put, put another one? Space them there. Something of that nature, maybe? Yeah? I think it's good. I'll go get one more. I dig it, Hunter. That is the Picasso. I'm welding her in. Why not a Leonardo da Vinci? Well, because Picasso. What's this? That's what's a different process. Okay, I like it, Picasso. I love this You could be, Grandma. There's lots of old guys on TikTok. You could be on there. I'm interested in old guys. Just checking. Oh, you're interested in the young ones? We got a little side project. Graydon, he had to go do his homework, but he's been bugging me trying to get me to help him do those. He tore them apart. I'll get them put on for him. He thinks his lawnmower needs a traction tire, so. Graydon's going to be digging in the lawnmower. All right. I'm not putting them on for him. That's his job. All right, now we just got to go through finish well the whole bottom of it. Then we can actually put this sucker on for the last time. Cage is done. Well, the inside part of the cage is done. Then we gotta figure out the back, but I'm waiting on some boxes. She's welded. Now we just gotta put it back on there and make it like permanent like you can put your lawnmower together today tires are on drive that sucker out of the shop then come back and sweep all that mud up fire her up I would, but I don't know. <laughs> oh, it's heavy. Oh, it's really heavy. I got it. All right. Well, then we got a cage in this thing today. That's a pretty good accomplishment, I think. It looks pretty good. As soon as some boxes show up, we got those ordered. They go right here. Don't fall down, Hunter. No, holy cow. We got a couple boxes that go on each side. Then we'll know what we can do off of here, down, whatever has to happen there. But until those show up, it's pretty much as far, oh, for the back. The front, we still got to build the cradle thing on top and the dash so that'll be next time so thanks for watching <laughs>